Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to secure your Tron wallet by changing ownership of the wallet in case your secret key has been compromised and the hacker has set a sweeper bot on your wallet or they manually uh, withdraw your money as soon as you send uh, Tron tokens to your wallet. So if you're sending uh, Tron tokens to your wallet and they instantly disappear, you will need to change your wallet's ownership, which means you will be able to uh, control your wallet from another wallet you have secured the keys. So the, the hacked wallet will not be able to transfer anything without the permission of your new wallet uh, we're gonna do that today and we're gonna test it how it works i have already tested it successfully and uh, so the first thing you have to do is go to tronscan.org also make sure to install tronlink to your browser so you can uh, log in to your tron wallet and uh, here, uh, here how uh, how a uh, normal wallet looks on the Tronscan.org. This is uh, a normal wallet, and what we have to do is go to the owner permission and edit here by adding another wallet, which will be owner and have access over over this wallet, which means any time we need to transfer uh, funds from this wallet we will need uh, a confirmation from our secondary wallet we will need a signature it's uh, almost the same like a two-factor fa authorization so uh, I have already done it with our wallet our testing wallet so we're gonna pretend this is uh, a hacked wallet here and uh, the hacker can anytime transfer this amount of Tron but after I have changed the owner as you can see here, I have added this as the owner, as the new owner of the wallet. You can see here, new owner. So uh, the hacker cannot transfer anything from this wallet without getting permission uh, from the new owner wallet. So basically, this is all you do, edit. Uh, set the threshold here at 4 this is the original wallet so you just add it. here it will not show this so you have to click the plus and add a new wallet and then add the weight at 3 then click save and uh, the now anytime you want to transfer from this wallet it will be impossible without uh, getting a signature from this wallet let's let's test it now send ten As you can see here it is confirming but it will stay like this forever it will never be confirmed and after a while it will be cancelled so uh, it cannot be transferred let's see here it is impossible but now if we want to transfer we go to our new 
new owner wallet and uh, click on the multi-sig transaction here and click on multi-signature trans uh, tran transfer and here we have we select accounts under control and it recognizes the account we have under control which is the the hacked wallet as you can see here ending with 5 bt and the receiving account which is a wallet we are uh, using and add the amount we want to transfer let's say we want to transfer uh, 15 sign now that we have gotten the permission from the new owner we can go to the hacked wallet and confirm it let's see first uh, if the transaction has gone through the one without a confirmation as you can see here it still says confirming but it will never be confirmed it will be cancelled uh, a few seconds later so we click sign and we will see that it is transferred as you can see here it is transferred and if we try to transfer again without the new owner's confirmation we will never be able to transfer here So as you can see here, it is super secure. Uh, the hacker now cannot transfer our funds anymore. We can control this wallet from our secondary wallet. So this is it guys. If you have any issues, if you've been hacked or any other issues and uh, you might need some help, uh, feel free to reach out to me and I will do my best to assist you. Thank you and see you next time.